Did the old prophets actually meet angels on top of mountains? Or were they highly intelligent beings from a galaxy far, far away? Today, we're taking a look at three well-known sightings of UFOs. Because let's face it, we're not alone, and the evidence is everywhere. In this video, we're checking out some strange images captured by the James Webb Space Telescope, or JWST in short. Space is a wondrous and eerie place. Many mysteries are waiting to be fully discovered. Via the recently launched JWST, scientists have been able to uncover more of these strange finds. If you're curious, let's get right into the video. First, we have a stunning photo of the Pillars of Creation. These are brightly glowing tendrils of gas and dust within the Milky Way. They stretch a vast distance across space. The pillars are located about 6,500 light years away from Earth in the Eagle Nebula. The pillars of creation are named that way because they are in the process of creating new stars. At the same time, they are being eroded by the light from nearby, newly formed stars. They aren't a recent discovery. The Hubble Space Telescope first observed them in 1995. In 2007, they were photographed for the first time by NASA, but JWST has allowed researchers to capture these tendrils in much greater detail. The telescope's portrait of these iconic structures could help scientists uncover new insights. This includes discovering how stars are born and how they shape the space around them. In time, perhaps the pillars of creation will provide answers about extraterrestrial life too. Next, we have Webb's Deep Field. This galaxy cluster is also known by its scientific classification of SMACS 0723. This is the deepest and sharpest infrared image of the distant universe to date. Webb's Deep Field was JWST's debut image. At the dazzling Jewel Field Images Center, a bright cluster of galaxies magnifies the light of stars. These stars are more than 13 billion light years away. All the while, thousands of younger galaxies sit in the background. Another stunning formation captured by JWST is the Phantom Galaxy. The Phantom Galaxy's many arms give it a spiral shape, like a nautilus shell. The eerie Phantom Galaxy swirls through space about 32 million light years from Earth. Scientists refer to it as a grand design spiral. This is due to how prominent and well-defined the galaxy's spiral arms are. Another galaxy that JWST has helped scientists peer deeper into is the Cartwheel Galaxy. The Cartwheel Galaxy is a rare sight. It is located about 500 million light years away in the Sculptor constellation. Its name is taken from its appearance, which is like a wagon wheel. This appearance is the result of an intense event, a high-speed collision between a large spiral galaxy and a smaller galaxy. Collisions of galactic proportions tend to cause a cascade of different, smaller events between the galaxies involved. The Cartwheel is no exception. This collision mainly affected the galaxy's shape and structure. The Cartwheel Galaxy has two rings. One is a bright inner ring, and the other is a colorful outer ring. These two rings expand outward from the center of the collision, like ripples in a pond. Because of these distinctive features, astronomers call this a ring galaxy. Ring galaxies are less common than spiral galaxies like our Milky Way. Another interesting feature of the Cartwheel Galaxy is its bright core. This core contains a tremendous amount of hot dust and has a black hole in the center. The brightest areas are also home to gigantic young star clusters. On the other hand, the outer ring is dominated by star formation and supernovas. This ring has been expanding for over 440 million years. As it expands, it plows into surrounding gas and triggers star formation. Like the Pillars of Creation, the Cartwheel Galaxy is also important to researchers. It allows them to uncover new details about star formation. They can also study how the Cartwheel Galaxy has changed over billions of years. Some of the JWST sightings remain unexplainable. One of these is a distant star with mysterious rings around it. The image was released on Twitter by citizen scientist Judy Schmidt. 
it shows a star known as WR140. The star is surrounded by regular ripple-like circles that gradually fade away. The circles are not perfectly round, but look rather squarish. This has created speculation about possible alien origins. After all, squares are rare in nature. The photo prompted a deluge of comments and head-scratching. Even some scientists are puzzled. To quote one scientist, I think it's just nature doing something that is simple, but when we look at it from only one viewpoint, it seems impossible. At first, to understand that it's a natural phenomenon, why is it shaped the way it is? Why is it so regular? Lastly, we have the Mountains of the Carina Nebula. One of JWST's debut images was the cosmic landscape painting of the Carina Nebula, located about 7,600 light years from Earth, lit up and sculpted by the radiation of baby stars. This is one of the most active star forming regions ever discovered. Obviously, there are no mountains and valleys in space, but this formation in the Carina Nebula resembles a landscape. This landscape of mountains and valleys is speckled with glittering stars. It is the edge of a nearby young star forming region called NGC 3324. Captured in infrared light by NASA's new James Webb Space Telescope, this image reveals for the first time previously invisible areas of star birth. The successful launch of the James Webb Space Telescope has advanced astronomy significantly. Through it, we can now see distant regions of space in much greater detail. This allows us to study them further and gain more knowledge. Perhaps we may even find we're not alone in the universe. Make sure to comment below on what your thoughts are, and don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Thanks for watching the video. Be sure to tune in next week.